Hey guys, it's DIY and Slime Life today. I'm going to be showing you guys a tutorial on how to get slime out of carpet or a couch. It works on both. And so this here is my watermelon sl jiggly slime that I got stuck on the carpet because I dropped some. And my mom is going to be home and she's not going to be very happy with this. So we're gonna get this out. So we're going to take, first you're gonna actually pick off any remaining uh, slime that's above that you can pick off and put back into the slime. So you're gonna take that and just scoop it in and that in there should be, you're gonna take your nails in there and get that out, okay? So that's about all I can get out now. So now we are left with this ugly red stain. So first we're going to use shop. So this is a laundry detergent. Well, not really a laundry detergent, but it's a, um, it's, it gets rid of the, um, it gets rid of the stains and it, it can get stains out of clothes as seen here. It says, it says to treat stains while fresh. So you wanna get this done as quickly as possible. So you can use detergent or stain removal. Stain removal, I found, use it works best. So you're gonna squirt the stain with some of the shout and then you're gonna take some paper towel and you're going to rub it and it'll help get the slime out of the carpet. And you just wanna continuously keep squirting it to keep, to get the slime out of the carpet. Now, colored slime is going to be like, like bright colored slime like this going to be hard to get out of the carpet because this is a very bright colored slime that I that I had dropped. See this is the color compared to the cow compared to the the carpet. It is, it is a very bright color and very noticeable. So you want to keep squirting that and just keep scrubbing and you can tell that the foam that there will be some soap that will start forming. Just don't worry, just leave, just let the soap be. And then, I, then once you got like most of it out, but there's just a little bit of color left, like you can see here, um, then you're going to peel back the carpet if your carpet does this. If it doesn't, then just skip this step. And you're going to spray in it to make sure it goes in it. Now, so, and you let, leave it a second so it can seep into the carpet. And then just keep scrubbing. Scrubbing is the key. You can go up and down, side to side, diagonal, left to right. It's not matter, just keep scrubbing is the most important part. Just keep scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing. And I'm gonna get another paper towel to get this out of the carpet. We're going to keep scrubbing this to keep this out of the carpet. And then you're going to spray it again. This does not, the carpet does not have to be folded up now. And then just keep scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing until the color is mostly out. You want the color to be pretty much out so you cannot tell that there was ever slime stuck to the carpet. Now, if it's a dull colored slime that you would drop and the, and the carpet is duller, it will be, it'll, you can leave less because the color, will, the color will blend in more to the carpet. But if it's a bright color like this slime that I dropped, you wanna work it really hard to get this out of the carpet. So now it's very it's unnoticeable really. We just can scrub it a little more just to make sure we get it all out. Spray it one more time with this. Scrub it again.
So that should be enough to keep to get the color out. So you can see there's a little bit of a tint left, but that's okay. And then you can see there's a white foam around. So you're gonna take another paper towel. You're gonna take another paper towel and lay it over the stain where it is. Press gently on and press hard on it. So and then you're gonna move it over and just press. Just press hard, and then rub a little. Now it'll look a little cleaner than the rest of the carpet, but that's okay. And like, it looks a little obvious now, but when you step back, it looks not as bad. Now the color will get, it'll get dirtier out as time goes on and it'll be less noticeable and probably people won't, and your parents probably wouldn't even notice it because it looks pretty much the same. And yeah, so that's how you get it out of the carpet. So hope that this tip works and make sure to comment down below if you would like another, if you'd like a video that helps get rid of uh, slime out of, the, out of your shirt and clothing and comment what kind of DIYs and slimes you would like to see, do you want to see my slime smoothie be mixed? Do you want to see all my slimes? And we can get to that later. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to Slime Life, Slime DIY and Slime Life. And push the notification bell to get notified when I update my content. And make sure you add me on Snapchat. My slime account, slime underscore life 88. And my DIY slime account on Snapchat, DIY underscore life 88. I'm adding everyone back. And I will be posting content every day on my on my uh, channel. So be, be aware of that. And I'll be posting as much as I can on this YouTube channel. So yeah, hope you have a great day. And this tip helps you. So bye.